self-directed care or attending care. I don't like this new Facebook thing because it's crazy. It just make you go live whenever, you know? But listen, that's the real question of the day. Self-directed care or attending care? So I'm going to get right to it. My name is Kion Church. I'm the big hearted caregiver. If you know me, if you don't know me, what do I do? I help financially challenged family members to become paid caregivers through the Medicaid long-term health care program. Now, today's question is, today's question is, which program is best for me? Self-directed care or attending care? If you knew the Medicaid long-term health care program, these are your only two options. You know what I mean? You're here because you want a paid caregiver. Move this camera up a little bit, y'all. So look. You're here because you want a paid caregiver. Now, it's only one way to get a paid caregiver. That's being Medicaid. And once you're in Medicaid, to be in a long-term health care program. The only way you can get a paid caregiver. But look, I'm going to tell you the, the whole ins and outs, the everything. I'm going to give you everything today. All I need you to do is hold on a couple minutes. Now, look, go through a little, you know what I mean, what I do. If you're here with me in the live, hashtag live. If you're here with me in the rebroadcast, hashtag rebroadcast. Now, look, my office assistant told me ain't nobody gonna really say that they here live because y'all like watching this and y'all don't like uh y'all like covid uh covert not covid y'all like covert people getting all this good information but look this information is so powerful that the person that you know who really needs it might not get a chance to get it unless you share it so make sure you see this you know what's going on and you sharing it because you definitely got some family members, some people, friends, loved ones that need this good stuff. All right? So don't be afraid to share. If you're here with me now, hashtag live. If you're here with me in a rebroadcast, hashtag rebroadcast. Give me some wild faces. I love them hearts. Miss Ludia, how you doing today? You know what I mean? Give me some likes. Whatever you got. Let's get it going. Um, one more thing real fast. It's this, it's this bar at the bottom. You can type anything you want into there. If you got a question for me, if you got somebody's name you want to bring this uh, broadcast to their attention... Type it right in there. Let me know whatever it is you, you need, you know what I mean? And we're going to keep it popping. John, what's going on, baby? How you doing today? Hey, look, this is what it is. It comes down to self-directed care or attendant care. What's really the difference? Well, if you hurt and you in and, 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 uh, you need some help, I'm not going to say you hurt, but let's say you need some long-term help. You're in the program. They're going to give you either attendant or self-directed. Now, Self-directed care is what these big companies do. You know, if you were a company and they got a two-part name, if it's a holiday and an animal, I don't really know. But the kind of service that they do is called self-directed care. Now, if you with the holiday animal company, they're going to tell you, uh, you're the boss. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I got a sign right in front of me that says, think like a boss. You know what I mean? But they're going to make you into the boss for real. They're going to have you doing all the work. They're going to make you find the attendant. The attendant is the direct care worker or, you know, your person that's getting paid. Because we're going to try to use terms that we can all understand. All right. So they're going to make you find a caregiver. They're going to make you pay the caregiver. They're going to make you uh, get the caregiver's application. They're going to make you get the caregiver's two-part TV test. They're going to make you get the caregiver's physical. They're going to make you get the caregiver's uh, background check. They're going to make you do the caregiver's uh, 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 child abuse and registry check. I don't know. But it sounds like you got a whole day full of work. You know what I'm saying? Or what you can do is you can subscribe to a company like Reliable Aid. And what we do is called attending care. Now, what's the difference what we do and what the uh, the, the animal company do? The holiday animal company do? What, what the difference is, is we do everything. You know what I'm saying? I do all the hiring. I do all the firing. You got to, even if you got a family member. So see, this, this is, this is, this is the hit right here. I'm going to tell you. You got a family member that, that ain't been showing up on the job. You know what I'm saying? And they, they, they getting all this money out of Medicaid and they not taking care of you. Guess who going to fire them? I'm going to fire them. They out of here. Cousin Larry, what's going on, baby? How you doing, man? What's up, man? She going to get them repairs done to that crib or what, man? We need you over there, baby. So look. If you with the wrong company, they're going to have you doing all the work. That's crazy. If you with reliably, we're going to do all the work. You know what I mean? You home because you need help. You're not running around in the streets. You don't probably don't go to work anymore. You, 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 you home. You need a little extra help. You, you, you need all the help you can get. You got family members. You're running around. You want to get somebody paid so you can get some consistency in your life. And then, boom, now they want you to do everything. p Foss in the building. My dude, what's up, man? Hey, yo, p Foss, man, when we gonna get this thing popping, man? You keep telling me, man, you, you trying to get on these turntables and you trying to get back, man. DJ Freechild said he can't wait on you forever, baby. You know what I'm saying? Look, I love y'all, man. We got a lot of things that we do, man. You know, 
A lot of people tuning in, man. I appreciate y'all. If you're here in the live, hashtag live. If you're here in the rebroadcast, hashtag rebroadcast. Now, look, I love all the people that watch this show on YouTube because, you know, y'all ain't from here. You know what I mean? Most of y'all not from Delaware, and y'all like, look, we love KC, and, you know, we, we, we trying to get this good Medicaid information. Now, listen, this stuff that I'm telling you, you got to remember, it goes on in all 50 states. 50 states is Medicaid, you know what I mean? 50 states that got the long-term health care program. In 50 states, if you qualify for Medicaid and you're in a long-term health care program, you can get what's called a paid aid. That's somebody who helps you around your house on a daily uh, basis to uh, to make your life a lot better. And if you were a company like Reliable Aid, you could ask for what's called attendant services. That way you ain't got to go through the hassle, stress, hiring people, firing people. You know, I fire your cousin if he don't come in right. You know what I'm saying? He don't come in every day. He out of here. We'll get you somebody else. You know what I'm saying? And then at the same time, if you need like some respite care, you know, why would you want to have to set up a backup person to come in? You, you was already having trouble keeping the first person in there. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy, man. Don't, number one, don't subscribe to any company that's uh, got a holiday animal name. You know what I mean? Because they go all the way, you know, they gonna hit you with no grease. Trust me. <laughs> you wanna be with a real company like Reliably. I don't know everybody face. You gotta you gotta say hey, what's up, man? But I appreciate all the thumbs and the hearts and all that. I just can't. I don't know who everybody is because I just be seeing like little pictures. But I would love to give you a shout out. You know, ain't no fun unless my friends can get some. So I shout everybody out that I can. You know what I mean? So look, moral of the story is if you're looking for a safe solution for your seniors or for yourself. You want attendant care, attendant care. I'm going to say it one more time, attendant care. I hope y'all saying that with me. I hope you know everything, you know what I'm saying? Give me them hearts. Give me that love. Give me them likes. I love the wow face too because if you see KC on the web, it's like, oh my God, he back again, man. He don't never stop, you know what I'm saying? We trying to get to the bag over here and I'm, I'm trying to get all the families that I can to the bag, you know what I'm saying? Last year, we was fortunate enough to help like 69 family members collect a check. Now, that was off attending care. You know what I mean? If you was doing self-directed care, I don't really know because you was doing something else and you tried to do it all alone. You know, they, they set you up for failure every time. But if you want to be on a winning team, on a winning track, Reliable Aid is it. Call me if you need me, 302-689-3240, 302-689-3240. Look, tell a friend to tell a friend, Psh, Reliable Aid is it. I got to go. I got a meeting, but uh, I love you and I'll talk to you soon. If you need anything else, you know, make sure you, you you click the link, you know, jump in the DM, get on me, put your name in the comment, do whatever it is you got to do. But let's get your care set up the right way. Reliably, 302-689-3240. Look, before I go, don't let anybody shame or blame you into thinking that taking care of other people is bad business. We doing this to get our blessings. Them other people, man, they whack. They going out by themselves. You know, they, they lonely. I, I don't know. They, they, they just don't believe in helping nobody but themselves. Me and you, we different. You feel me? I love you, baby. Take it easy.